What's up everyone, this is Live Talk is Tech, and today I'm going to be showing you a really cool Siri shortcut Easter egg that you can find on the iPhone, but while I'm showing you this Easter egg, I'm going to be showing you a bunch of other really cool ones that you can find on iOS. Let's get started. So these are some of the coolest Easter egg that Apple has provided us in iOS that I figured would make a great video for you guys. So later in the video, I'm going to be showing you a really cool Siri shortcut Easter egg that I find very interesting. So the first one is, if you look closely at the Maps application, that is actually the location of Apple's headquarters, and you can see the number for the highway that you have to take in order to get there. Another Easter egg that's pretty common that people know about is when you go on the wallpaper section and you look at the time when it says 941, that was actually the time the first iPhone was released. And if you look at the image on the left, that is the time it would be in your time zone for it to be released, which is pretty cool. This next Easter egg takes place inside of Apple's store app. So if you tap on the search icon and go ahead and search up a product, typically nothing happens but just your usual search result. But if you type in let it snow, you're immediately gonna get this really cool effect with a bunch of snow, and then of course you're gonna get Mac OS 10.6 Snow Leopard, which I think is pretty cool. And you can go anywhere inside of this application and see the snow. So I guess if you're shopping for a new iPhone in the winter, I guess you can get that winter experience if you type this in before purchasing or looking at a new phone. Now the Siri shortcut's pretty cool. So if you go ahead and type in the QR code scanner, if you're gonna create a new shortcut, a lot of people don't know this, but that QR code is actually a legit QR code. It's not just a random image that Apple made to represent a QR code. So this is actually pretty cool. So if you force press on the camera application on any 3D touch device, you can open up a QR code using your native camera app and you'll immediately get a notification from Safari letting you know what that QR code actually links to. So that's exactly what I did on my iPhone 6s Plus. That's what that notification was. You can see once you scan that QR code, you get a bunch of images that say think different and a bunch of cool Steve Jobs quotes. And you also get a few ads from Apple back in the day. And this kind of brings me to my next Easter egg that Apple has. So a lot of people know that the older iPods have an actual scroll wheel that makes a really cool clicking sound. And Apple did not discontinue that with the death of the iPod. In fact, they kind of brought that over to any sort of selection menu inside of the timer application. So when selecting a new timer, you can hear it has that sound. So that same sound you heard while scrolling through the minutes and seconds in the timer application is the same sound you hear on the iPod Nanos or any other older iPod Classic. Now, speaking of old classics, I guess, this next Easter egg has the old Apple colors, which is pretty cool. This is inside of the wallpaper section on your iPhone, so you can go ahead and then just go to your wallpaper category and you'll see the rainbow Apple logo match the rainbow wallpapers that Apple has provided in iOS 11 and they're still present on iOS 12 today. So you can see you've got these really cool wallpapers with the background and these backgrounds I guess match the tone of the 80s or 90s of Apple in that time period which I think is pretty cool. Anyways that is about it for today. These are just some really cool easter eggs I thought of. I think it would be a really cool video idea. I do know it's a bit late so I do apologize for that but thank you so much for watching and as always peace.